So the Meek Men tribe weren't really the assholes the whole time. Now let me tell you guys that this chapter was very, very, like, wondering, like, what the hell is gone, going on in Zhao, and what the hell went down in Zhao besides knowing that the person that attacked Zhao was Captain Jack. And yeah, if you guys don't know where Captain Jack is right now, he's off to go save Do Flamingo. Yes. Two badasses. Okay, so we all know that Captain Jack's a badass. Um, he might be like maybe one of the top commanders of the Kaido crew. Like he might be like, you know, his his uh, commander number one or commander number two. I don't know. But I have a theory that maybe Do Flamingo is commander number one, not knowing that he's secretly working for Kaido. But I don't think I don't know. I don't, at the same time, I don't believe this theory could exist. It's just a theory, so... My, like, I can't even believe this theory, but it's, it's just a random thought, because... How else would Captain Jack be wanting to go save Del Flamingo to go up against Fujitora and every other else? So, it's obvious that it looks like... I don't think this arc is going to be like a battle arc. This is going to be like, yo, we're going to get some information about the Void Century. So, because there's a lot of history involved with Zhao. And we finally get to meet up. The Straw Hats and Trafalgar Law finally get to meet up with uh, Beppo and his the, the two other uh, dolphin clown looking fools. And so, apparently Beppo, he left his tribe. 10 years ago so he doesn't really know much about the mink men but he was able to like shut him up you know like he was able to like keep him down um like from attacking until so, like uh the nami wearing clothes mink men chick like kissed luffy on the forehead i was just like who the hell is this chick like don't like I don't understand, like, does Sanji ever, like, would he ever get turned on by any of these Meek Men tricks because these chicks I met, because that would be bestiality, just so you guys know. And the thing about hentais, though, they get really crazy about that stuff. But, uh, we might be able to see, uh, hopefully we'll be able to see maybe Weeble in the next arc, not this arc, because this arc is kind of like, you know, yo, we're going to go find the crew, we're going to get the hell out of here after we get the information, we're going to probably... Hopefully that Luffy will get a new Straw Hat crew member, um, because Oda said, yo, we're, uh, yeah, the Straw Hats are going to have definitely more crew members, but I think is that, um, what I think is going to happen is that the Straw Hats might, instead of getting, the, they might get a crew member, but they might also make an alliance with the Meek Men tribe, which would be smart. You have a crew member, then you have a Meek Men tribe, like as your as uh for this upcoming war because it as it seems that it's gonna be you know these meek men tribe are probably going to help luffy and law his alliance and um and be able to fight kaido because that would be an awesome fight that i i want these meek men tribe to actually join forces we they, they would actually be a huge asset because they put up a good fight against uh law's crew guy like one of them actually knocked the shit out of um, the big dude because he had uh, arm him in hockey and the big dude just, you know, he went down because he doesn't have arm him in hockey and then Luffy just went up, boom, knocked that other dude out of his ass, the guy that knocked that that crew guy out of his ass. And dude, Luffy's just badass. And then the gorilla, you know, throw a banana at it, it'll start doing that to the banana, yeah. That's... <laughs> That's what the gorilla does. Um, yeah, yeah, you just give him the banana and he'll start something. But, yeah, other than that, this was a great chapter overall. In my opinion, I'd give it, like, uh, uh, let me flex. Uh, I'd give it a, uh, hang on, hold on. I'd give it a, uh, 7 out of 10. Eight, seven, eight out of ten. It was a great chapter. I wish there was more, like, I don't know. I kind of wanted to see the Meek Men tribe, uh, like, grab it. Or, I think her name is Carrot. I wanted her to get on her ass. Uh, not literally, like, you know, like, bending over and going on the floor. But I wanted Zoro to put her on her ass. 
but not banging her. Um, um, but let me, uh, let me know what you guys think, though. Drop me a like if you haven't subscribed. This is JJ D. Uchiha, and have a nice day.